Hey guys, um, still on a two inch spacer. Oddly, these are plastic. Hmm. Um, just gonna raise it up two inches so I can put some 31s. Cause these are no good. I got wore out too quick. So put some nice tires on there and get a get an alignment and that way the treads won't whirl as fast because it has um, thicker treads They're the same price as the regular tires so I think it's a good idea um, unbolted these unbolted this which is a sway bar link not too bad obviously I took off the tire and it wouldn't wouldn't go any lower so i thought uh oh now what um that was the other thing i unbolted here just used a breaker bar and a wrench because it was an odd size and uh as you can see that should be enough get the spacer and if it's not I can take this one off as well so these tracker arms hold it I mean they should swing down but they kind of bind so it stops it from moving down so that was the trick if there's anything else I'll show it in the next clip because I don't have fancy editing okay so hopefully that, that helps somebody um, these are the rear shackles, they go here to lower the, the rear leaf spring, they go in here and lower that, it's adjustable two or three inches, so that would be nice, and I'm going to get some coilover shocks for here while I'm saving up for these if I need them because I'm gonna put coilover shocks in paint the rest of this and that's about it I don't have to put blocks because these are pretty nifty they're gonna lower it so and then um, after that get an alignment so if you got any other questions let me know Looks like how it's done. This is, um, let's see. What is this? I ordered from ordered from Priority Mail. No, I'm just kidding. What company was it? Jeez, I think they'd want to put their logo. That stuff. Where's the name? Front leveling kit. Huh. Didn't put their name on anything. Huh. Oh, I'll put it in the next video. Okay. I just ordered it off eBay. It's just a bunch of kits. These are just made out of plastic. Hmm. Okay, thanks. I'll be back.